Hey y'all, and welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna show you how I make my fried ribs. So the first thing I always do with my meat, um, I typically will wash it off, and then I will flip it over and remove the membrane off the back of the rib. Now this is optional, you don't have to do this, but this is something that I always do whenever I prepare ribs. And I'm just sliding um, just a little knife right underneath the back of the membrane, and then once it's loose, I will remove the remaining with my hand, as you see I am doing now. And you see it will come right off. It's real easy to do. So after I have removed my membrane, I went on and washed off my meat again, and then I am slicing it down individually one by one after i had sliced all my meat i grabbed a bowl and placed it inside the bowl and then after it's in a bowl i grabbed some marination sauce and then i marinated my meat for a good 10 minutes while my meat was marinated, I went on and grabbed my pan and added some oil. And as that was heating up, of course, I was um, adding seasoning to my meat after I had already marinated my meat for a good 10 minutes. So you can season your meat to your taste, whatever type of seasoning that you like, you can season it. And then I was just flipping the seasoning throughout the meat. After I had added my seasoning to my meat, I grabbed some flour and then I was flouring my meat. So I just did everything all in one bowl, which is a whole lot easier and faster. After that, go ahead and um, grab your meat and place it in your pot, pan, So after I added my meat to my pot or pan, however you want to call it, I added some butter. Now this is also optional, but this is something that I always do. Whatever type of meat that I fry, um, I always add some butter. I just like that golden look after it's um, done. So I let my ribs cook four to five minutes on each side. And then I will flip it on the other side and let that side cook also four to five minutes. It doesn't take long in my opinion, but it also depends on the type of stove that you do have. And as you see, it's done. And this is how I prepare my fried ribs.